During the last two years, when the pandemic was on, we saw that how India's medical services are insufficient to take care of our population. And what is going to happen in future is the India's population is also aging, like the world population is aging, and our requirement for such medical and critical care will increase. Not only the requirement of India is increasing, the world requirement of such technically qualified and skilled personnel is also increasing because the world population is also aging and the only country which can provide such technically skilled young people is India. I lead considering the requirement of the market is introducing this year four medical related courses namely BBA in hospital management, optometry, medical lab technician, medical instrumentation and critical care technology. Critical care in India has grown significantly from a, just a set of professionals to a full-fledged set of active uh, speciality. This meaningful pragmatic vision is so meaningful because it has emphasized on one very important fact that this growth should be focused around scientific and academic environment. The global critical care device industry is growing, is expected to grow from $455 billion in the year 2021 to around $567 billion in 2081, which means it is significantly growing at a CAGR of 5.4%. Now, in India, in the domestic market, it is expected to touch $50 billion by the year 2025. This significantly again shows the importance of uh, critical care technologies in India and the requirement of huge critical care technologies in India in the coming year. In critical care, a patient's life is very much dependent upon the ability of critical care technologists. There is no room for an error because if there is an error, it will lead to a loss of life. So, wherever it, uh, whatever it is, whether it is a private hospital or a government hospital, even a medical unit will always have a critical care uh, center. And all the people, all the professional people who are into this critical care center handling the critical devices are known as critical care technologists. After the three years course of critical care technology, they will get a job in the intensive care units, they will get a job in critical care units, they will get a job in emergency units, even in uh, uh, operation theatres in anesthesia units as well as ambulatory services as well. Students who are uh, willing to go for higher education can also go for masters in this domain. ILEAD is introducing this course in this year 2022 that is BSc in Medical Instrumentation and Critical Care Technology affiliated to Maulana Abul Kalam Azad University of Technology, Kolkata, West Bengal with the best of the infrastructure, qualified faculty and industry integration.